Okay, now we've got the wave right behind Walk set up with two more very exciting, powerful surfers with a CT experience of their own. Having a look at Callum Robson from Australia, David Silva of Brazil, the defending event champ, Silva. But it's been all about powerful surfers, and no surprises that David Silva is straight down to business, Binzi. Yep, no surprises at all. Defending champion, deadly on his backhand. It's still pumping out there. The mid-tide, as we've mentioned, is uh, treating Ribera beautifully. Bit of work for David to get through that one. There's a run of a few heats. Meanwhile, having another look here at live action. Silva, again. It's getting foggy down there. Yeah, Joel Vaughan, the only other Australian left that might just slide under David out the back. Maybe David's using the, the fog to his own advantage. He's just going to sneak attack into one. Oh, there he is. Talk a surf ball. Yeah, Silva, crack him on off the top. And we talk about surface having muscle memory. You can really sort of visualise what David Silva's doing on this wave. Anyway, as he just drives. Let's see if we can get a replay here of David. Yep, that's uh, the man all in blue on his backhand. We've seen that turn through a wave here. Binzi, talk us through it. Yep, thankfully he's got the yellow rails on his board so we can see what he's doing. He's up into the 30 litre club. I was having a look at his craft yesterday. And uh, yeah, he's a beefy lad these days. He's filled out. And uh, well, has cracked this one from Whoa. start to finish. He's about as good of an opener as you can hope for conditions like this and now under priority we see him seizing on a inside opportunity he only needs one point to move into the lead but he's gonna you know multiply that by a factor of five or six or you know maybe even more depending on what he's got for us down the line takes to the air releases the tail rides out of that one nice and smooth and uh, this is going to be a very solid backup for the man from heaven's head in the red jersey 18 and a, half a couple of minutes from him Let's have a look at the replay. He's done a tear Zabrowski. Oh, strong up into the lip. Open face carve. You know, it can just be a bit of a pacing maneuver, a setup turn, but done very nicely with a minimum fuss and allowed him to unleash on that section and then get through to the inside before deciding it was time to preserve his fins and get out of there. But Alan Robson will now move into the lead with 18 minutes to run in this heat. Yeah, really well surfed, wasn't it? All the way through, it just kept providing him with opportunities. And we've seen some of the big power turns and gouges that time going above the lip and just flaring right up here. And he gets that nose pick and makes sure it's not an easy section. On his guard, Calm would love to get rid of that 583 and really take this one by the scruff of the neck. Here goes David Silva using his priority. So this is seen a long wall stretching out in front, climbs up and over the foam. Not many points banked so far. Now Silva works his way through the gears. Just the one turn, he's out of there. So a bit of a uh, moment there. Callum Robson picking up priority is the sort of main takeaway from that last minute of action. You want to get amongst that sort of energy. What do you reckon he saw in this way that made him take it? It looked a bit soft from the get-go. Yeah, it looked like it stretched out a bit. So maybe he thought, you know, with a big long wall, there might be a few more sections on offer. David Silva's bored and in the prime position to do stuff like this. He'll go here, use the priority. Good looking opening section. Here goes Callum. He'll just get past that first white water and then he'll just open up and hold that rail line for ages. Now the steep section cracks it again. So a great looking wave. He's in rhythm here and he's still going down the line with intent. And he'll just snap out the tail over the white water. Don't think he'll threaten the eights. 583 is the backup number. We threaten that? I think so. Yep. They've really stood up and bowled back towards him. Speed to burn right now, puts the back foot down, plants it, throws a big bucket of water, and then a second arc. And then a little bit of foam work up and over, keeping the fluency down the line, and got the finish. Yeah, the big opening blast is where the points will come from for Callum on that one. Uh, yeah, if he can put together a six or a seven, then there's going to be a little bit more pressure on David Silva's back. They're at Portugal, round of 16, heat four in the water. The defending event champ up 
and swing in live action here, looking to get himself out a bit of a hole. Needs to go excellent to get past Callum Robson, score in one wave, and he's driving over a section, banks over the soup, and then stings out a quick hit and keeping that speed up. And he'll rotate and go over and blow out the tail. So finishing with a flourish there. Great response from him. He's such a good competitor. Binzi, did we see excellent surfing here? Um, uh, I mean, Callum got an 8 one no, seven, I guess three, I'm guessing. For what his opener. No, so that's excellent. Just, um, uh, just a little bit under for mine. I think he, he sort of had to work really hard to get the score. It was great surfing, don't get me wrong. Uh, I'm not sure whether it all just clicked perfectly. It's a flat wave, wasn't it? It was, yeah, and you know, even here, had to force that a little bit. Maybe even the fist pump there was a little bit of trying to force it. And there it is at 517, so not even close to excellent. Yeah, it comes in quite a bit under for him. He's pushing hard here, and he's good enough to make those kind of decisions as well got that technical turn done but it's not a massive point scoring turn meanwhile look at this speed and flow from Callum Robson straight into it really nice opening combination I tell you what he is on here at Ribeira he's really locked into the juice and he's just enjoying himself he can kind of cruise through that turn and he'll set up maybe look like he wanted a ramp he found one earlier but Callum looks like he's really in tune with everything's going his way at the moment. Glitched halfway down that wave and went from attack mode into a uh, cruisy guy on a twin fin at the pass in Byron Bay or something. But uh, yeah, all the uh, points done up the top. Right about now, he's like, oh, what's going on down the line? La -di -da. And, uh, no, no section, I'm out of here. So that's not going to go into Callum's top two, but still, he has yet to make a false move in this heat with seven and a half minutes to go. That's still going to be a 5-5. The throwaway it would be in David Silver's top two. So Callum Robson has made every post a winner in this heat so far. Seven minutes. We just lit that thing up, got an eight right there by just multiple assaults on the lip. And he knows exactly what sort of wave he's looking for. He thinks he might have found it here or used priority and he's got some speed. He's loading up. And he'll just go float to out the back and not what he was after. And he's been relatively by his own standards. He's just been trying. He's been rallying. He's been catching a bunch of waves, but nothing really offering him anything like that. Excellent number. Well done, Callum Robson, who the quiet achiever, just four waves ridden and getting excellent on the get-go. Put good numbers on the board as well.